Hi everyone. I wanted to show you my new planner that I just released for this Black Friday weekend. It's my 2021 calendar and I'm so excited to walk you through it. So let's head to this page. We're on the index. This is our first page. Um, each month is linked and once we head to each month, each week is linked and then also if we click on that we can head back to the monthly view click on january and here is our yearly view as well now each corner of every page you can click on it that takes you to the index let's click on june for now and as you saw um every week is linked as well so when you want to click on the that weekly view you're going to click on the right corner of saturday so that will take you to each week and then if you want to head to each day you can click on that number and then that took us to june 4th now i didn't write the dates on it. I thought it's fun to go ahead and write it yourself. So let's do that June 4th. And this is our 2021 calendar. And then let's go ahead and show you the stickers that I have added into it. Um, we're going to click out of the pen so we can click on our links. Click on the corner. This is our index, and then there's the full view. There's our stickers. Now these are already inserted in, so what we're gonna need to do is click the pen lasso, and then you're gonna circle around which one you want. Hold down, take a screenshot, click out, and copy. Now, let go of the pen, click the corner, June, and then we're on the fourth, so let's head there, and then we held down, and I'm going to click paste. Now it does look a little bit boring, but that's because it's so big, and we're not going to keep it that big. But first, let's crop it down, so we don't have as much white space. And there we are. Now it looks a lot more clear now that we have it the size that we're gonna keep it as. Um, let's put it up here for now. And then, so there was our sticker page. Let's head back to the index. Well, first of all, maybe I'll talk over this page. You have today's date. Um, you can write down your daily schedule here, and these blank slots allow you to put in your own time frame, and then priorities. I like to only have three things each day so that I'm not too overwhelmed, and I think th the number three is a great amount of things that you can actually accomplish in a day. And then you'll feel better about your day after you get those three done. And then here's a big open space to write down all of your other thoughts of the day. Or maybe make a doodle of something that you feel inspired by. So yeah, that's our monthly, or sorry, our daily view. Let's head back to the index. We have a to-do page. You can scroll through. We've got a couple of those. There's our sticker page. Here's some blank pages in case you want to add your own inserts. And then we also have a list of the holidays right after the index. And I like this page. It's to allow you to write down your birthday. Your birthdays because sometimes when I'm looking at like my monthly view, there's a lot going on, and birthdays to me are really important, and 
I want to have them right out in front of me where I can see them and remember them. So, yeah, there's that. I can show you just how I can quickly write in it. Let's see, my friend's birthday is on the 15th. And let's write her name. And then my brother's is on the 19th. So, yeah, you can just go ahead and write like that. And then let's take you back to the index. At the bottom, I have some links. This is going to take you to my YouTube where you can get more information on how to insert your planner and use stickers. So thank you guys for watching.